the knocking fish were tied. That's what you are. Because you when know you that you are a reward, a silent kill. Your brain is that of mid-gets, academically. I cannot intimidate me. Shoma, why is your face this way? What happened? I don't think I can go ahead with the marriage arrangements anymore. Why would you be so fast to take that decision on a marriage proposal both families have agreed on and uh, some certain uh, uh, marriage ritual performed? Why? Father, that's because if I get married to that beast that calls himself smart, I will be living in agony and regret for the rest of my life. Of I course, nothing me. like that will happen because I, as your mother, will not allow it to happen in my lifetime. You see, that's smart. He's a son of a bitch to make you feel this way. Who is he? Why would he try to frustrate and intimidate my daughter? Victoria, why are you being irrational? Why would you make such judgment, you know, when you don't even know nothing about this? I must act fast and intervene for my daughter at this early stage because you men are evil. Mother, hmm. hold your peace. I made the pronouncement, and I can as well cancel it. Oh, good. Tell that to your mother. She is the chief justice of the Federation, a woman whose mantra is, meet me in court. <laughs> Look at her. Dr. Wisdom, I enjoyed the accolades. Had it been your former mother or father-in-law, had stood up at the right time at the initial stage of your intimidation, your first wife would not have died in cold blood. What? Mother, did I just hear you say uh, first wife? Oh, yes. David's mother, your father here, killed her. Victoria, the day of reckoning is fast approaching. You prove that I was the one who is responsible for my first wife's death. The amber of discord that you have been fanning, you'll be swept inside abyss. The Magnum Ridge is coming and you'll be eluded. Dr. Wisdom, I am not afraid of you. I am fully prepared for you. Yes, and I'll make sure I see you to court. And make sure that you spend the rest of your miserable life in Damn it! And you will be get to the dead! You die! But as soon as I will not go to and because I was not sure I was right with the boys and I don't care! You give me any time! Why? Because I'm not ruling you! Because you have a long time! You don't have any time to try! You are not going to deal with it! I will leave you and I will leave everything! Aaron, Aaron, today, today will mark the end of your life. Yes, you have been dragging people's land and be going scot free. But today, this my own will hook you. I will kill you today. You idiot. Emeka, you think I'm afraid of you? I'm not afraid of you. Eh? I am not afraid of you. I'm going to take that land from you and as well imprison you for life. You are an idiot. Who are you? Who is he? This is idiot. Me. You will imprison me over my own land because you have a son in the city that is doing for than I be. Akwaya! Let me tell you, Ezoha and his cabinet will hear of this. Yes, they will hear of this. <laughs> Imagine, the ones you told them. What happened? Eh? Tell me, what happened? I went into the farm and I harvested my cassava. You went straight to them. You told them, tell me what happened. You this idiot. Nani, please leave Emeka. Emeka is just an empty drum that makes the highest noise. Ah, look at me. Martina, is it me, Emeka, that you're calling empty drum? <laughs> Martina. Do not forget in a hurry. Do not! Do not forget what in a hurry. What is he saying you should not forget in a hurry? Ask your wife. What is he saying? 
Emeka, you are a monkey. Spineless human being. Thank you, Agos. Let us Spineless be. human being. Thank you, Agos. Thank you, Agos. Idiot. Thank you, Agos. I'm not afraid of you. Thank you, Agos. Respect is a reciprocal. Cause this time I run to a bomba to bomba. If you venture across my way, you go feel I'm hot. You dey marry me, let me say you be my yoga. No dey to write me, cause we get a poor idea. One can set for who so poor Kalia. But if you love you day, peace you go day. If you love you day, oh, peace you go day. Godia, Godia, mm. there's something I observed when Emeka was, make, was talking. He said you should not forget in a hurry. And you suddenly went dumb. What is it that he's saying you should not forget in a hurry? What? Dim, what do you expect me to reply to that finished man? A man that is just a negative of his former self. Yeah. Uh -uh. I only kept quiet because I needed peace to reign, that's all. I would have said, because immediately he said that statement or threats, or is it threats? You, your countenance suddenly changed and you feel defeated. Defeated as how? I observed it. And there's something between Emeka and I or what? Nanya, I don't like this. Sometimes you don't talk childishly. Hey, 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 hey. why? Huh. Hold your tongue there. What is it? Let's go. I've asked, and you've told me. I've clarified my doubt. So what are you, what are you what still talking? What doubt is it? What doubt? The earlier you stop this suspicious behavior, the better for us. I said it's enough. What's Huh? I don't like it. You don't like it? I'm only suspect. Oh. You are going in a hurry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, mm -hmm. See, my love, mm -hmm. I think the time has come for us to separate Paul from Barnabas. <laughs> Paul from Barnabas. Mm -hmm. <laughs> This one is a PhD. <laughs> I don't understand. This is your idiot. Hi. <laughs> hey, whoa. Look, permit me to say, I think the uh, 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 bride price, the dowry they paid for your mother's head, is a waste. According to Ibo Hadej. The love of my life. You have spoken in error. And I want you to withdraw that statement right now. Okay, my love. I withdraw. Hey. Mm. Mm. Mama did mama. Mm -hmm. Mama, I was waiting for you to refuse papa. At least let me see both of you quarrel for once. Hey. Let me just see. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Enemies within. <laughs> My love, I never knew our adversary was even closer than I expected. Mm? Hey. <laughs> mama, please don't be dramatic. Hey. You see what, what this, this, this I was talking about her when I said it's uh, time to separate Paul from Barnabas. Uh, 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 I understand now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. You mean me and you, Paul, mm. she, Barnabas. Papa, <laughs> Papa. Hey. Papa. Mm -hmm. I was thinking that you would even ask Mama why she's calling me Barnabas. It's true. Mm -hmm. Okay, why are you calling her Barnabas? Mm -hmm. I will explain. Explain yourself, Mama. <laughs> Naturally, mm -hmm. you know that Nkechi here is my only daughter yes. and my only child of consolation. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. If we separate her, uh -huh, then maybe very soon she will call me for Mogo. Uh -huh. Okay, I understand. <laughs> that means 
Omugo is, hor is hungry in us. <laughs> so when she, when we talk about Omugo, then mm. we are talking about. Uh, uh, <laughs> go, go, go. Uh, 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 and secondly, Nkechi mm. uh, here is beginning to interfere in our matter. Uh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mama, where did this one come out from again? Is that true? No, no, Papa. She has even started telling me how to share things with you. Hey. Uh -huh. Which one is it? Hey. Uh -huh. Mama the mama. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Papa, it's not she true. No weapon fashion against this love. Shall she pass her. Yeah. And this is our love. No knife can cut it. But okay. Where? It's made from heaven. Blown to Amen. Blown to no child will put us on that. Amen. They will cut, cut, Amen. cut. <laughs> Nothing. Papa, <laughs> truth be told, I should be blamed for her actions. Although she didn't give me a chance to explain myself. Okay. Be straight with me. What did you do to her? She came to visit me on an house and then she found two girls in my house fighting. Who are the ladies? Have you turned your house to a brutal? No, Papa. They are... They are my exes. I, I told to go their separate ways. I, I wasn't interested anymore. Who are the ladies? You told them to go their ways, but they kept coming. Coming as what? Coming as your new bride or what? Papa, eh? I, I, I'm only telling you this so that you can help me talk to her. That's all. Uh, me? Help you talk to her? Yes, Papa. Go back to Chioma and beg her. Go back and beg her. Go back there. It's all right. Um, I'll try my best. Meanwhile, I'll... Uh, um, better. I'll send money for the plastering and the rest of the job. Okay, okay. All right then. Ah, six five. Hey. <laughs> hey. I will finish you today. Hey, hey. Double six. <laughs> Choose us. <laughs> Three, six, seven. Give me. I'm going to watch you come with it because oh, yeah, I don't want you to cheat me. Oh, yeah. This one don't go. Hi. This one don't go. <laughs> go back to your uh, house. Uh, you see what I'm doing? <laughs> Mama. Uh -uh. Hey. <laughs> you both are enjoying your games. Yes. You're, uh, you're welcome. <laughs> As you can see, I'm giving it to him hot, hot. He's even begging for help. <laughs> are, you, are you sure of that? Uh-huh. <laughs> I've been winning her. I've been winning her. Okay. Between the two of us, tell me, who, who, who is under pressure now? I can't tell. The truth is that both of you are happy. Mm. So I think nobody is losing and nobody is winning. Shoma, you are a very good judge. It's a draw game. <laughs> no, not a draw game. It was 6-2. And even that two you had, it was just messy of just that you are my everlasting love. <laughs> That's why he's saying it. Right. Shoma, <laughs> look, my love. Mm -hmm. Even if am I not still your baby? Of course, you remain my baby, but <laughs> accept that I won you. That's what's important. <laughs> so, Mama, you mean Papa has been winning you to all this while. Don't even go there. Hey, Shoma, please sit down. Hi, Mia. Yeah. Huh? This food is very delicious. I'm glad you like it. I must have spent a fortune to repair it. <laughs> Very fortune. What would my dad say that kind of money to give me? Mm. I don't use bonga and crayfish. Nothing much. Oh. That's all. That's all. You are really blessed. <laughs> you don't even know what you have. I understand you. <laughs> what do you mean? The kind of love your mother and your father share together. Uh. It's not like my house. Do you know that each time I come here, I find peace. My house, there is a wall. Choma, please enjoy your food. We'll talk about that later. Talk about what later? Hmm. When my mother has refused to, Obey my father's authority. She wants to drag everything with my father. 
I think you should allow them be. If they haven't killed themselves since, it's not now they will kill themselves. They've been living together since then. Everything will be fine. I'm beginning to go into depression. Depression, what? Please. I think you're too young to start talking about depression. I don't have peace from the people around me. Not even my parents. Not even from smart. Smart? Is it not the same smart that bribed me to intercede on the matter? Do you remember how my ex-boyfriend treated me, right? You mean Onyeka? He treated me like a pure slave. Why should we never come by this time? God. I'm hungry to go keep person I swear to God. Mama know the pick call now. Show my why now. I thought the food I brought for you yesterday would have lasted to this morning. Good. But Mama, you know, I don't have kerosene in my store. And I don't get money. And she am not going to bring me to ask me for money. So the soup for this world. Now that you have starved yourself the whole day, has it not amounted to pennywise pound for each? I swear. I swear. I swear. Well, let me get to it. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. She your mom my life giver. <laughs> oh, you stop flattering me. Eh? Why would you be calling me your life giver? Am I God that gives life? See, ne, eh, you see, as long as this life they consign, eh, ne, you deserve any kind word. Who I call you? <laughs> you are my life giver. I swear. Okay, okay, okay. Oye, it is not called life giver. It is called caregiver. But God would have provided you another caregiver if I'm not here for you. Na lie, na lie. See, eh, show me. No woman, born of another woman, eh. Would have been like you. Mm, they look at you now. You, you get heart of gold. Eh? See me, which kind lady? We supposed to love person like me. I'm not fan. Poor boy. <laughs> mm, child. Okay, I said, I'm your destiny helper. Eh, uh, you know my. See anywhere where you want me, I stand there. Eh? I go stand, shout them, say, eh, trauma. Now my destiny helper. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> Stop it! Are you out of your mind? Are you trying to force me into having sex with you? Yeah, which kind of nonsense ah, 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 question is that? Eh? Do you expect me to be watching you like television? No, nah, I feel this now. Wow. How can I? I thought we had an agreement. No sexual intercourse. Which kind of nonsense agreement be that? No, which kind of nonsense agreement be that? Isn't it? I, see, I'm a woman being happy. Come on now. Eh? No, but I can't do it. I have to go. Boom. <laughs> I'm so surprised about what you're telling me now. You didn't tell me that you went as far as giving Onyeka money. My dear, I even bought clothes for him. What? I went as far as convincing our barrister, our family barrister, to be able to recover a land for him. But how were you able to convince the barrister to offer the service for free? It wasn't really for free. I have suffered for that guy. Please tell me. My ears are itching. I had 
to tell our family barrister that he was a friend that has been intimidated by the uncle over a piece of land that was left by his late father. And that was how he was able to recover the land back. Oh my God. And upon all the help that you rendered to him, he still betrayed you on a broad daylight. You know, sometimes I ask myself if I'll ever be loved by a real man. Because all I've ever gotten is betrayal. Onyeka almost raped me. Now I'm smart. Wisdom. There is no way you are going to take a chieftaincy title and expect me, Victoria, to be your lover. Hmm. It's not going to happen. It's either they give me a chieftaincy title as well or not. That's fine. There's no way you're going to maneuver the tradition. Not at all. Because you are fighting for gender equality. You cannot maneuver the tradition. You see, it's time we have to change some certain narratives in your tradition and norms. This taking women as a second class citizen and men as a first class citizen. If they don't stop it, the war will be endless. Mark my word. <laughs> oh, Victoria. Oh my goodness. It's high time you stopped this your feminist malady. Let it end with you, yeah? Because if you make it public, I bet you you'll be ostracized by the community. Just mark it. <laughs> Let me just pretend as if I did not hear what you just said. Because you, Dr. Wisdom, you are not a stranger in my life. You know what I can do and the extent I can go for anything. As for your AZ, your king, your so-called king, if he tries anything stupid, I will make sure I seal him and his entire cabinet and nothing will happen. And you know what it means when I do that. Just sit your nagging ass where it is. Because you know nothing about tradition, you just returned. My piece of advice, if you want to leave and enjoy your retirement benefits, don't try the traditional institution for your own good. Do you think I fear your tradition? Or your customs? Does it look like I care? This is not all about Dr. Wisdom. You're facing the community. I still believe in gender equality. No first class citizen, no second class. We are L. Maybe you take that to somewhere like Queen's English. Maybe you will take it to England. This is Africa. I'm talking about your so-called custom and traditions. You can write your own history. This is our history. And I'm here to change it. You cannot change it because no one has ever done that. Watch me. I see what will happen. I have finished watching you. You will know nothing rather than what you're seeing here in my own house. This chapter is just beginning. The chapter is ended as far as Dr. Wisdom is concerned. Keeping dozy on you in this house with the slippage things you do that have been tolerated. But you see this one, I am not going to tolerate it. Right? I want you to tell me why you decline smile. You fancy. Father, I am no longer in love with him. Excuse me? Have you gone daggers? Were you not the one who accepted his marriage proposal and his people started the marriage formalities? Why would you turn down right now? Chama, listen to me. I wouldn't want you to truncate, jeopardize, and tarnish my image in this community. Is he smart? You must marry him because he has gone far in the marriage ritual. Do you hear me? Girl, I'm sorry, I cannot. I can't go ahead with that marriage. <sighs> 
Wisdom, I have had to. I had what you said. Now I want you to bear in mind that as my parents forced me into marrying you, that will not repeat itself where my daughter is. Well, I'm saying that Chioma is my daughter and I've decided that she will marry smart and that's final. Then be ready because I'm going to sue you for child abuse and marriage enforcement on my daughter. Oh yes, why would you as enforce her into marrying someone that she doesn't love? Nah, go in and rest. Don't mind your father. Chioma, if you move an inch, I am going to do the only match level. And Shama, I said, go inside. Not listen to you. Hey, hey, you must remain rooted until I say otherwise. Okay, in that case, there is no problem. In one of two ways, you choose one. Is that that she goes inside or you go? Well, I, I wouldn't like to sit here and listen to your mother because I know she's a small rat. I'm going inside there to reinforce. And by the time I come mm -hmm. back, she won't be sitting here comfortably. Let me go inside. That's the language of a loser. You will see. Indirectly, you have chosen to leave. So, my dear, your father, Dr. Wisdom, would have stayed here to carry out his threat. He would have seen what will happen to him. I mean, why will he try to force you into marrying someone that you don't love? Why? It's okay. Thank God he didn't hit you out of anger. As in, hit me? Me, Victoria, out of anger? For what? Ah, that would have been the end of his freedom in this life. He would have wasted his useless life in the prisons, awaiting trials. Anyway, that's by the way. Mother, please, it's okay. You guys are driving me nuts in this family, seriously. You and father. Who is having issues? Will you shut, shut up? Why would you say that? You are the cause of this problem now. Now you are, you are saying that we are driving you nuts. Um, why did you call off your relationship with Smart? Mother, Smart is a womanizer. He's a playboy. I can't marry a man like him. Um, a playboy, womanizer. Did you see him making out with any lady? With your own eyes? No, um, I, 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 or uh, have you started listening to gossips lately? Respect is a reciprocal, cause this time I run to a bomba to bomba. Venture across my way, you go feel I'm hot. You Look at you. Stop it, Joe. Hey, Hi. this one that you came to my house to sell money. I hope everything is fine. My dear, everything is fine. Meanwhile, how about your parents? Ah, they went to the farm. I was feeling sheepish last night, so my mother just asked me to stay back. Are you sure? Yes, now. No problem. Hope you have taken your drugs. Ah, yes, I have. I've taken everything. I hope oh. you everything is fine. My dear, nothing is fine now. Uh -uh. You know now. Eh, hey, now. Suffering and smiling. Uh. No retreat, no surrender. I know. See, let me tell you, eh? I couldn't even sleep last night. I brooded till daybreak. Uh -uh. What happened? What were you thinking about now? Everything. Nkechi, every single thing. I don't understand again. Um, Chokwalo. Meanwhile, um, what is that her name? Elizabeth and I. We saw you yesterday discussing with um, Smart. It's like their traditional marriage is around the corner. <laughs> Kali Kali. So why do you ask? You know now. Mm -mm. I don't know anything. Okay, you see, eh? I want you to help me and talk to them. Eh? To fix me into their Ashebi member. I want to be part of the Ashebi. Oh, who knows? I might even meet my uh, Mr. Wright there. Hmm. And your maybe love. So they can give you free Ashebi uniform. 
and other benefits that comes with it, of course. <laughs> now you're getting the gist. <laughs> ah, very good though. See, I might just go there now. Bam! Meet a man, ja! Before you know what is happening, I'm in a man's house. Hmm! Kali, Kali. <laughs> Kali, star baby. And pot of fish are hit the, the, the floor of romance. You're there. That's so. Hey, I'm. Meanwhile, just try and fix everything, eh? Mm. Arrange everything. Mm. If I marry mm. you, mm. anyone you're married. Does not actually come to this, okay? Look, do not come to name callings and murderous attack. Understand? We can resolve this and make it believe. And make it believe? Chris, how? Do you know how many times I've been calling him? When I was coming here, I was calling his phone countless times, he refused to pick. And I know he's inside his house with, with the woman. Chris, Chris, when he's inside his house with the woman, come on, sir, Chris! I disagree with that. He's not with the woman, okay? He's not with the woman. See? As I said before, we're going to resolve this, okay? Just, just calm, be calm, be patient, okay? Huh? So, and that reminds me, there's something I've been meaning to ask you. Um, I want to ask you something. Chris didn't anyway promise you marriage or something? Um, well, by indication and application, yes. But orally, no. But do you know that every time a suitor comes my way, I will tell your friend. Every time, and then he would just nod his head, and then he said that okay, we should just be together. And you know that I love your, your friend so much, I cannot leave him for any other person. I mean, it's okay. Um, wait, but what you're trying to tell me is that Chris is aware of all your suitors, and yet he discourages from marrying any of them. Yes, yes, and I, I, I want to assure you that this fool is not going to leave me like this. I'm not going to be a lot and allow him to marry another woman. Chris, I'm not going to allow you, Chris! Listen, it's okay, it's okay. You know what? Like I said before, it's okay. Everything will be okay. You know I'm his friend. I will talk to him on your behalf, okay? Trust me, he's going to change his mind on that, okay? You talk to him for me. Sure, I will. By saying this, I know that you're a very reasonable person. And you know that I love your friend so much. I understand. Please talk to him. I will. I will. This, this idiot cannot leave me like this. He cannot do this to me after six years. Sweetheart, you can't be calling him. Either. Don't worry, I'll show you how to talk to him. You guys will make up, okay? okay. Right, just calm yourself, right? right. Thank I'll you. see you later. Don't, don't, don't worry, don't worry. Just, I'll talk to you. Okay. Alright? Yeah? Alright, thank Take you. Take care of yourself, okay? Alright? By the way, you look gorgeous. He should have at least opened the door for her. No? At least he know I didn't go to work. So I'll put an end to her madness. You know how this girl is. You know how she gets angry. That's a problem, man. I didn't want her to come in here and unleash her rats in this house. She will bring down the roof. That girl is the daughter of Jezebel, bro. Come on now. What's up with you, huh? Is that why you discourage her from her six shooters that were approaching our door? Now, apart from her, Anger issues. That girl is a beast in bed. I mean, she's the real deal, bro. I'm, I'm telling you from the depths of my heart. Hmm? I guess you're lost on the first day. Hmm? Maybe. Oh, so how would you do it? You know you want to get married to Chona. Once Chona moves into the house as my wife, hmm. give me a moment. I will pack out. Huh? Mm -hmm. I will. Alright, alright. So what you're trying to say is that um, definitely Jennifer will not be a tree. Put that tray to rest, right? Of course. Uh, well, I think you say so. In terms of, you know you're the game planner, man. <laughs> alright, alright. Right. So I'm worried about that job I was telling you about. Man. Yeah. Best 
Betty. Hello, Betty. 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 Where are you coming from? I went to your house and your mom told me you were not allowed. Eh? I came to ask if you've been trusted, so we'll go and fetch water from the stream as we agreed today now. You and water. Eh? Well, anyways, I went out to oh, yes, though I didn't tell my mother. Hey. And where are you coming from? <laughs> Betsy, she you remember that other day we saw him um, smart discussing with Nkechi? Hey. The other day now. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. Exactly. Yes. Mm. My dear, I was curious enough. I had to go to Nkechi's house because me, I must definitely figure something out. I went there and guess what? <laughs> my thought was right. <laughs> 100% right, though. I'm not joking. See, I even told her, I said, eh, eh, please, so I want to be part of the Ashwebi in case anything eh, fix me in. She now said, no problem. I'm telling you. She agreed just like that. Hey, now. Kali Bebe. Just like that. Just like that, though. Eh? See, let me tell you more. Tell me, do you know that? Aside from that one, eh, she assured me that my Ashwebi cloth mm. is free of charge, mm. plus other small, small benefits that comes with it. Eh? Like this, see me see Ashwebi. I'm telling huh? you, Kalista. Mm -hmm. So you had all these plans in stock, and you couldn't call me your friend, let's say. You are selfish, you. No, no. It was selfish. It's not like that. Why are you talking like that? See, I went there. Having it in mind, I'm just coming. I would still tell you. You will still tell me. I know I will tell you. Sure, you will get free Ashebina. What of me? You didn't know you would put me in budget as your friend. It's not late, so. Eh. Don't, don't, anyways, don't. See, I, I told that the most important part of it. That's me. I want a man. So as I'm going there now, my main target, main aim, is a man. I want to catch my own bobo. Eh? If I'm dancing mm, here. <laughs> <laughs> eh? Very important. You will catch for me too now. Um, Betsy, eh? you come and be going eh? Let me go and answer my mother. She's at home, okay? I'm coming, I'm coming, my friend. Kalista, Betsy, my food you later now. Go, go, go. I'll see you later. Okay, you have done your part. There is no problem. You've been watching me work. I've been watching you for a long time, and I can say that you're quite energetic. <laughs> uh, I think you're flattering me here. I'm not flattering you. I'm an old man. There's nothing I can do to. <laughs> That's <laughs> do, not I can true. Do more than this. <laughs> but you are working like a man of twenty years. Oh well, what can I do? What can I do? <laughs> so <sighs> where is uh, Mama Kechi and Kechi? Ah, uh, she was here. We came together, but she had to leave early enough to go check on Kechi, who is not feeling too well. Oh, it's a pity. <laughs> ah, okay. I got something for you. You got something, something that for will me? be helping you with your work. At least you have some energy. This is cook. <laughs> you know, too much sugar is not good for an old man like me. <laughs> uh, but, Komo, you make a very good wife. Mm -hmm. You yes. should be going to the church all the time, mm -hmm. thanking God for giving you a woman like me. Oh, <laughs> mm. You like it, right? I like it. I really needed it because my energy was was sad. Mm. <laughs> ah, thank you so let, much. Let me hold this for you. Okay, thank you. Mm. <laughs> you want me to share it? Yes. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Your sweetheart looks like uh, 
They even put chocolate. <laughs> this one is sweeter than this one. Mm. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Oh. You need it. Yes, I need it. Mm. <laughs> I'm beginning to feel something. Um, well, 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 well. I don't want to say I are. Uh, mm -mm. <laughs> Everything is very costly, but I know we must survive it. Eh? Mm. We must, by the grace of God. I bought this uh, garden egg for mm. you to eat. I went around the whole market mm. looking for the paste you like eating it with. I couldn't find it. Exactly. Please manage it like this. You know why I call you good here? Yeah. No, no, you tell me. Eh? Tell me. Because you know how to unlock my pockets. <laughs> uh, uh, I, can I take this now as a compliment or as an accusation? <laughs> Even when I swear that I will not give you a dime, eh, you know how to perform magic and you will release the money that I don't want to give you from my pocket. Even at times when you don't ask for it, I'll just give it to you. <laughs> Run the mirror, a born comedian. Ah, ah. <laughs> hey, hey, <laughs> but you, you understand what I'm saying now, eh? Ha. When you just make the request, Piam, Aaron, the strong man, will just become a soft gel, on to budget. Oh. Oh, don't worry yourself. <laughs> this evening I will massage this hey, always hey. very well for hey, you. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> you have come again, no? <laughs> you have come again, eh? So now, mention your request. I don't have any request. Eh, I don't have. You don't have. I just want you to tell me what was the outcome of the meeting you had with the Wisdom's family the other time. Hey, hey, that's what I'm saying now. <laughs> I know that none of your romantic guest choice without a request. No. None of them. <laughs> well, as it is, it sounds like uh, the marriage between Shioma and Smart our son will not hold. What? What happened? What's the problem? Choma said he's no more interested in the marriage. Does our tradition permit that? Ah. You needed to see the fire in Victoria's eyes when the traditional provision was mentioned. Who is Victoria? To go against our tradition? What does Victoria know about our tradition? Who told her? See the size of this bed when she ever gave it to me. <laughs> Hi. Mm -mm. So it was bigger than this, and you brought just this little quantity home. Can you imagine? But Mama is right. Mm -hmm. You ate three quarters of the bread mm -hmm. and brought this one for us. Yes. <laughs> that was how I did to the quarter of the job meant for the three of us alone. <laughs> so what goes around comes around. Uh, First off, my <laughs> love. We have become political about this issue. The love of my life, <laughs> you two have become apolitical. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, mm -hmm. uh, Choma is a girl with a heart of gold, mm -hmm. and I know that girl will make a very good wife. You're very right, Mama. She's a very nice girl. I mean, she cannot stand to see someone suffering or in need. She will sell a value possession just to save a soul in need. Mm -hmm. ah, <laughs> she's a nice girl. I like her. I like her. She's oh, see. you people don't want to I, give me bread. I, 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 I give me. I, I drink mineral with you. Eh? Yes, sir. <laughs> Papa. I saw sure my bought me mineral. I used to download the, the bread now. So she even gave me mineral? Yes, sir. And you brought this, this dry bread for us. Oh. Eh? Mm. This one, mm hmm. <laughs> it's not fair. Oh. It's not fair. It's not fair. If you want to buy a mineral for us, mm. you will. 
Mm -hmm. Mama, what do you think? They are supposed to 100% mm -hmm. life and direct. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we are saying, Save us mineral. All I am saying, I will buy you mineral. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, bro, on your defense examination. Thank you, Tommy. But then I'm not happy with you. Why? What did I do? Come on, I'm your only brother. How come you can't call me on the phone to exchange pleasantries? It's not nice. I'm really sorry about that. But you know how mom and dad quarrel used to make someone go insane in this house? Yeah, you're right about that. The last time I visited for my project, it was a tug of war between them. To the extent that mom insisted that the dad has to input the same amount I was asking for, for her as well. Imagine that. No, you're joking. No, I'm being serious. Same amount? Yeah. That's not even the worst case scenario. Mom revealed an ugly secret that day. I was shocked to my bone. And you think I don't know about it? <laughs> Seriously? That we are half brothers and half sister? Yeah. Then tell me, we shouldn't let that come between us, right? Of course, it wouldn't. So, brother and sister forever. Forever. Come on, you know I love you. <laughs> mm. I actually missed you and I have a lot of catching up. Oh, really? Mm, on those, you know? And look at you, Mom. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you so much, Mom. I called you here to talk to you. Because oh. I know in this community, you are the closest person to Chioma. And she listens to you. And that's why I have called you here to talk to you about her. Mama, what about Choma? Did she not tell you why she decides to call off her marriage with Smart, my son? Mm -hmm. Mama, I think that Choma is in a better position to answer this question. Don't you think so? You know how her mother behaves. So there's no how I can go there to ask her. Mama, see what's going to happen. I will invite her over to my house so you can come there and talk to her. Hey, mom, that's thoughtful of you. Oh. Eh? Oh. That would be good. So what time can I come? Um, mom, let's leave it for tomorrow afternoon. Tomorrow afternoon. I'll make sure she'll be there. That would be good. Thank you, Nketi, mom. Yes, ma. God bless you. Yes, ma. Chineke goze re mm -hmm. eh? It's okay, mama. It's not okay. Thank you for the drink, mom. Nothing. I'll just finish up so I can quickly go home. That's all right, my dear. Thank you. Uh, my son, I must uh, tell you that I'm enthused, you know, to see that today you are a graduate. Very soon your sister here will also become a graduate too. <laughs> Thank you so much, Dad. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a gradual process and we owe you and mom much appreciation. Thank you so much for everything you've done. Thank you. And so. we can't wait to start paying you and mom back in due time. Yeah. May you continue to live long for us in Jesus' name. Amen. Oh, amen. I'm happy that even my beautiful daughter here is wishing me well. Yes, <laughs> that, of course. Are you not our father? Oh, you know, before now, I used to think that your mother is walking on your psyche to head. Wait, wait. Come off it, father. We are adults. We've come of age, old enough to take care of ourselves. And we know what is good and what is bad. That, well, as Choma rightly said, mm. we are grown. So anything that happens now, it will just be us looking like fools and we are not. Well, it's a thing of joy to know that uh, I have been reassured. And my tomorrow is promised. Thank you very much, my children. Thank you. Thank you. That you're welcome. All right. Having come this far, um, Choma, I think it is high time you told your brother and I why you exchanged your relationship with Smart. It's very important. Um, Father, 
Yes. I can't spend the rest of my life with that womanizer. My image is very important. You have to consider. It. For me, this is an impudent adventure. Reconsider. For St. Peter's sake. <sighs> Mama, I hold you and Papa an apology. And because of that, Madame Martina invited me. What apology, Nkechi? The thing is, Choma and Smart have been on a separation note for some time now. And that has been a threat to their family peace. It's a lie. Nkechi, so you can keep secret from your father and I. Eh? Mama. Not minding how close you, we, we are. Mama, it's not like that. Okay, so uh, what is causing your trouble? Although, um, Choma asked me not to say anything. So I decided to keep my mouth shut now. What happened is, Choma visited Smart Uninformed. And when she got there, she met two lady friends of Smart. And they fought naked over Smart. Are you serious? I'm very serious. Ha. Huh? So because of that, when Mazi Aaron heard about the, the issue, he now decided to visit Dr. Wisdom, at least to resolve the issue and to fix a date between Choma and Smart. But when he got there, the Wisdom's family chased him out of the house. Okay, if I get you, if I understand you correctly, Martina is trying to use you to get your mother's heart. Oh, Mama. <laughs> <laughs> Mama, dear Mama, when I told you that you are an ageless queen when it comes to love matters, now that is the idea. <laughs> okay. <sighs> You see, Martina, Martina is more sensible than that her husband. She resists better than Aaron. Mm. Anyway, Mama, she'll be coming here tomorrow. Yeah? Ha. Have you informed your father? Mm. Not yet, but, but I'll tell him. Ha. Please do. I will. Okay. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mama, for understanding. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> ah, kitchen one. Yes, Mama. I can't believe that you can keep secret for such a long time from us. Then that means we're no longer safe. Uh. But it's not what you think, oh. My friend asked me to keep the secret. Because the, the matter is really sensitive. So I just decided to keep my mouth shut. Oh. My love. Oh. The day Nkichi told me about this, I was shocked. I was frightened to my bones. The Nkichi of all people. Ha! From that day, I swore never to trust even my own soul. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, what? Mm. Hey, Mama, he hasn't got into that. Mm -hmm. Okay. What if I had revealed the secret that she went to Smart's house instead of the school that we use as Brow? And the mother gets to find out what will not happen? Well, I think you are right. At least now we know you are a mature lady that can keep and maintain secrets. Mm. Oh. Congratulations. Stop. <laughs> You've had class for yourself. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Mama, don't be a <laughs> 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 the Romanos? Uh, the 
Isinze. Isinze, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> this one you visited me in my sun site. I hope it's well. All is well. Uh, yeah. You know the elder says that the toad does not run in the daylight in vain. It's either he's pushing something or oh. something is pushing him. Bam! That's exactly <laughs> what I'm saying. <laughs> Ezoha messaged me from abroad last night. Huh? Yes, he said I should come and see you. See me? Yes. He said you should go and meet in the Udoka. The secretary. For you to render the account of the, the cassava you have invested in the disputed land. Or else, <laughs> you wait for his rot. But, it's in the, the truth be told. I did not sell the cassava. We used it. So how can I quantify the cost of a cassava that I did not sell? Are you asking me? No, now. Are you asking me? See, what gives you the fearless God to dispute Ezra's has judgment? Yeah, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry about that. You see anything? But I was thinking since I am the one that planted the cassava, and I have right to harvest the cassava I planted. Anyway, I've messaged you. That's all. Hey, these people have ganged up. They've ganged up. Kalista, what is it? You look as if the world is about to crash on you. Eh? You look so pale and worried. Maga Chapotago is out. What is it, my girlfriend? Talk to me. You see, oh Betty, I don't know what is going on. Betty, I don't know what is happening. Eh? Why is it that each day I go hunting, that is the only day antelopes them will learn to climb tree? Am I different? I don't know what is going on. And what is the problem? Eh? What is the problem that has kept you in this kind of uh, situation? Eh? Talk to me. I'm your friend. I'm here. Betsy, hmm? as you're looking at me like this now, I'm finished. You are not finished. Betsy, I am dashed. Yet another disappointment, though. All thanks to Smart. And Choma. God bless them very well, Lo. Every time they will be fighting, quarreling, those two. I don't know why they are fighting always. Fighting and quarreling? What happened to the two of them? Why are they fighting? You see, I heard that Choma traveled to the city to go and visit Smart without his knowledge. On getting there, she now jammed two girls. They were fighting, you know, fighting too hard, fighting so dirty. Hey! Because of smart. Hey, with the key. They were an aqua. No, I'm just trying to understand the scenario. Please wait. And who are these two girls, if, if I may ask? Are they smart friends? On your own friends. Friends, Onye. Smart and we're friends. They are not his friends, anything. Eh? I heard that Smart promised them marriage. You know, city girls and no kwenu. They be found a hard, but we be know they enter those people. Eh? He even went as far as paying their dowry. Uncle Kwa Uwe Sifa. Eh? Yes, so. Abomination. Hey! You mean Smart paid their dowries? And they sell Smart as a pet for Choma's dowry. I'll be about to pay. I don't know what to say. At this point, I eh, had the womb speechless, dumbfounded. I cannot even find myself. Hmm. Story has it that Choma even ran away from the house with fears in her eyes. Hey! Obunu Gigano, will you stay? I will borrow wings and fly away. Hi! Mm -hmm. Now I know why you are so moody. Eh? But if I'm you, I should be crying by now. I'm not seeing any tears yet. I, I mean, I'm just trying to. If you know what's good for this daughter of Casey Bell, ask her to leave my house now before I kill her here. Come, come. Okay. Well, say I'm out to talk. This is your friend. Say I'm out to talk. God bless you. I did not stab your chest. That's why you are still talking, you this shameless idiot. 
see you. I will kill you. God bless you. Wait, wait, wait. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Jennifer, you see, I don't support this, okay? Your action was barbaric, huh? You know you could have been sent to jail for all this. Listen, listen, if this girl does not leave this place before I go in and come back, you have yourself to play. So I don't see. Bears of the same feathers. Hey, look, don't come at me, right? I mean, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not smart. Try me, I will dismantle this on wakey face for you. Wakey face? Yeah. This thing that smart did to me, will you allow him to do to your sisters? Should I curse them? Should I curse your sisters and your, your, your incoming wife so that this thing will happen to her? Should I curse them? You are backing for him. Is, is that right? It's quite unfortunate, you're not my sister. I will stab you to you. Ah, Mother, I escaped my death today. What? I saw the devil in her eyes. Chioma, were you mad in the first instance as to push a city, a city wide beast who has been a prostitute for years? Thank God you escaped from her. I am so lucky today. She know the worst part of it. That same bitch you're talking about brought out a knife from her bag and stabbed Smart. Smart was stabbed? Blood was gushing everywhere. Thank God for his friend that came and stopped him from bleeding for some time. It was disastrous. Hey, I said it. Then your father would not listen to me. I know that nothing good will come out of that philandra. Eh? That, 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 that's Casanova. <sighs> Mother, I never knew people can be this, this desperate. To the extent of stabbing someone and also threatening to pour acid on my face. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. So it got to that extent? Mother, she meant every word that she said. <sighs> no problem. Just wait until your father comes back. A doctor, fast turning into a traditionalist. I must vent my anger on him. I will not spare him. What is it? Why are you looking scared and frightened? What Monday, happened? I escaped my death today. Wait, don't tell me you had an encounter with, with uh, um, um, arm robbers. Eh? Was it an accident? You remember that wild lady that I told you I saw in Smart House the last time? That wild, crazy lady. Uh, yes, 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 yes. I remember. What happened to her? She saw me today. As a matter of fact, she caught me and Smart today and threatened to bait me with acid. Jesus! Wait, oh, was Smart not around? Which Smart? The one that received a knife cut from the lady. I think it's a joke. You mean she stabbed Smart and even promised to do more and do more if he does anything silly with her? My goodness. Wait, Yuma, are you being serious right now? I'm not recovered from the shock. I'm so sorry. I'm very sorry. Thank God nothing happened to you. Because you know I was the one who virtually forced you to, to give Smart a second chance. I'm so sorry. Eh? Smart. Udoka! Udoka! Let me remind you. Eh? You are not going to gain anything. Even though I should banish me and my family from this community. Nothing you will gain. Aaron. Yes? Why are you parading yourself as a warlord and the richest millionaire? When will you ever be humble and be apologetic? Uh, in essence, Udoka, you are telling me that you are not going to help me out of this situation, isn't it? So how can I help you? Ero, tell me, how can I help you when you faulted and disobeyed the Zewa? There is nothing I can do to help you. Hey, you are not helping me. Eh? 
Quantify the cost. I have 10,000 in my pocket. Hey, Ron, I will not touch that money. Huh? I will not touch the money because Ezio had told you to bring 60,000 naira. Hey, 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 hey. 60,000 naira for my own farm. 60,000 naira. My own farm. Hey, I will damn the consequence and walk out of here. Whatever you want to do, you and the traditional ruler, I don't care whatsoever. I don't. Aaron does not know what he's playing with. I am warning Aaron. You are here now because you'll be the one now to be telling me the uh, love of my life. No, I am warning Aaron one day. I will so deal with him. Because the gentle stride of a leopard does not mean that that leopard is weak. My love, calm down. Eh? What is it? I saw Aaron on my way. Was he coming from this house? He came here to make trouble with me. He's making trouble with me. Aaron is making trouble with me. When I saw finish with him, eh? Okay. No problem. Please, my love, eh? Calm down. But, ah, are you supposed to be having issue with Aaron? Uh, yours is just to deliver the message from uh, Ezoha, and that's all. Exactly. Exactly. But Aaron will keep making trouble with me. He, he, he said, uh, what will I benefit if, he, if he's banished and whatever? And so for that reason, he started backing at me, backing at me. But one day, I will use him to show an example for this community to know that Udoka is not a weakling. Wait, so I, don't, I don't understand. Shouting down at you for what? Are you Ezoha, or were you the one that advised him to uh, uh, disobey the advice of Ezoha? That is what I don't know. That is what I don't know. But something tells me that there is something that Aaron is looking for in my life. And I will let him know that he does not have any portion in my life. Okay. And I will make this community know. Please, my love, just forget about Aaron. Who is Aaron? Eh? You want to lose your sleep over, uh, over Aaron. He does not want it. Worrying over Aaron is like uh, uh, wasting your time and energy. Please forget about him, Biko. Eh? Forget about him. Yours is just to uh, 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 deliver the message from Ezoha and go to bed. Forget about Aaron. Ah. Thank you. Thank you, my love. I'm gonna smile for me. Mm. <laughs> Smiley. Mm. <laughs> smile, I mean, forget, forget Aaron with Aaron. <laughs> I love my life. Love you know, my I hero. don't like seeing your face like this. I know. I know. <laughs> you just have to thank your God today. That is, if you have any God, that nothing happened to my only child. Because I know you have been trying everything humanly possible on your side to make sure you disinherit me from this family. But the God I serve will not allow it to happen. It will not work at all. I, I, I see her Imperial Majesty. Oh, yes. I have seen that the madness that is running in your family lineage is gradually catching up with you. You are the one causing panic in this family. You are the one that is mad. Yes. Just imagine. Look at yourself very well. You are accusing me of being the one causing panic in this house when you are the chief Confucianist yourself. Oh, you think I did not know that in your quest to be given a chieftaincy title, that you insisted that my daughter Chioma must visit uh, Smart. You think I will not find out? See, I am tolerating this rudeness of yours so much. Uh, oh, shut up! Shut up! What is all this? Excuse me? Are you pointing finger at me? Give me my own. Is it because I've been tolerating your excessiveness in this house? I will deal with you, and by the time I deck you, you will understand who I am. Let me tell you, Dr. Wisdom or whatever you call yourself, if you don't like your freedom, if you hate your freedom, just lay a filthy finger of yours on me and see that I don't give threats. I do not Now, direct your finger. Let's 
Do you not do anything? I said it. Yes, you're a sickness bulldog. I'm not going to do nothing. Let me do my Let me Let me do my So instead of apologizing for your stupidity, you're here claiming rights. Huh? Smart. I don't really understand. Huh? Are you angry because I uh, told Jennifer about your mom's visit? Huh? Look, let me ask you something. Are you going to keep on hiding her uh, even when you marry her as your wife or something? Even when you know she's even your wife? Hold on a minute. Be... Are you trying to tell me that you're now a spy? Spying on me and taking information back to her as her spy? What did you see? I said what I said. You said I'm spying on you, right? Oh, yeah. All I'm saying is that you should sit up as a man. Sit up as a man. Look, what, what, what am I? What are we, what are we, have, are we having a conflict on this? Huh? Real men digging in and out of ladies with their senses intact. They don't allow that jeopardize their union. So, what are you trying to do? Let me ask you a question right now. If you're to marry a uh, trauma now, are you going to be hiding under the caves? Why are you so scared of Jennifer? You're a man for crying out loud. Yo, 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 yo. Mind your old trousers. Mind what you say to me right now. All right. What do you mean by I'm scared of her? Why should I be scared of her? All right. You have to save that question. At least you're playing the piper, de detect the tune. Oh, I see. Now I see you've been the enemy of uh, Yeah, for real. Okay. <laughs> and if I say I regret meeting you, then I'm not joking. Oh, la, la, care. You think I care? Do you think I care, right? Look, look, you know what? The truth will surface one day why, why you're running away from Jennifer, why you'll be so scared of Jennifer. Really? Is that what you're telling me? Yes, that's what I'm telling you. You know what? I'm done. I'm done, right? done having this yeah, useless yeah, conversation. I'm, I'm done, I'm I want done. you to get the hell out of my house now. Get out! I'm getting out of this place, all right? Do, 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 think, do, think, do you think I'm staying here with you? Huh? Do you think being a real man is like putting up with this Stevie Seeker sign of hell style? Oh. Man, if you want to come to Rima, go to Rima, I'll teach you what we'll do. I feel fuck off here. I'm done, done. Yeah, well, my daughter, how are you? I'm fine. How are you? Well, you can see me and I'm okay. And you? I'm good. So, why didn't get you go um, for the journey? Uh, she left this morning with her mother. Oh. Yes. Really? Yes. Oh, really? <laughs> so, when did they say they'll be returning? Um, I think on Thursday. Yes, on Thursday. Well, sit down. Why? Hey. So are, you? Um, are this not your wife's clothes? Oh, yes. Yeah, my wife's clothes. Mm. You also wash her clothes for her? <laughs> of course I do. She washes mine. I can as well wash hers. It makes no difference. Wow. We are one. <laughs> you know, I've been wondering, did you ever get angry and hit her? Like, beat her up or something? Angry? to hit my wife. Uh, I don't think that there will be anything of such that can ever make me want to hit my wife. It's like hitting my own self. She's the love of my life, so I don't see any... I, no, I can't even imagine it. Me beating my wife? No. Okay, beating myself. I mean, I'm mad. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> hey. I love you so much. Oh. You're a man of peace. Oh, thank you so much, my dear. <laughs> Look, I mean every word that I just said. Okay. I love you from the deepest part of my heart. Oh. <laughs> you see, as the bosom friend of my beautiful daughter, we all love you. <laughs> we love you too. <laughs> and we will continue to express our love towards you and, our, and your family too. <laughs> I don't know what I am saying. Uh, it should be only Vegeta should be not me. But to me, it's 
it's a pet name. And do you know why I gave you that pet name? Yes. Because I love you so much. Oh. <coughs> and I know you're the man. You're the only one that can give you peace. <coughs> I am the only man that can give you peace. I have you forgotten that I, I am the father of Nkechi, your friend? Please. It is nothing but a number. I don't care about it. It is you that I want. I love you, Papa. But, hey, there are so many young men that can give you peace around. I'm an old man. How can that be? And this your hand here is my body is already doing something though. What? Is that what you mean? My body is already shaking. Choma. Eron. If I were you, eh? I will go home and do some mental assessment and find out if is there anywhere your family and my family share common boundary. Huh? Then why this land? Why are you dragging this land with me? Becca, now I know you are very, very senseless. Ask me why I said so. Eh? I said so because that land, I inherited it from my wife. And it was given to my wife by her relative. Mr. So, will you, will quiet, you close your mouth? Will you keep quiet there? I'm talking you. You inherited the land from your, uh, uh, from your wife. You said the land was a gift from your wife. And who is that relative that gave your wife that land? We are welcome. I advise you go home and ask your wife some question. If not, you are going closer to your grave. Did I just hear you threatening me? Eh? You me you are welcome. Well, I heard that you are threatening that you will kill me over that piece of land. Small piece of land. Eh? But let me tell you. Eh? My son, Smart, eh, will come after you with his team of lawyers. I'm not a killer. I'm a gentleman. I promise you, you are going to see that. Welcome. Did I hear you say, Smart? Yes, you heard me right. We shall see. Mm. Let me tell you, eh? we will live to see. Meanwhile, go home and ask your wife some sensitive question. That's what I want to tell you. Ask my wife sensitive questions like what and what. Idiot. You're a very stupid man. Monkey. Now I know that you're a brainless man. Yes, I need to do that for that matter. <laughs> Let me tell you, I advise you go home and ask your wife some question. By the time your wife asks you that question, you will now know that you are living in a fool's paradise. Oh, oh, fool's man. No sense. Me, Aaron, living in fool's paradise? Yes! Fatima, or whatever you call yourself. I just want you to listen and listen very good. You see that issue of uh, illusion? It no longer exists between us. So, from today, I don't want to see your leg to my house or the leg of any of your people, your family, into my house. You will regret what I will do to you. We are no longer in-laws. My in-law. Things are not hurriedly decided like this in traditional matters. It has some traditional procedures to follow. Especially in marriage matters. No matter the offense. I can see. That you're stupid. I can see that you're shameless. You're worthless. Look, if you want to doubt the possibility of what I can do, anywhere you see me in this village around here, just attach that word. You see that word, Ongo? Attach it to. 
my name, then you will say what I will do to you. Like I said before, we are no longer in-laws, period. And don't address me with that word, Ogo, even here now. Madam Victoria. Bera. You better ask questions. I know you are a returnee in this town, but the, you will not understand certain rules and customs. Enough! Stop it! When your husband comes back home, just tell him to calculate the total expenses that you people have made so far on the head of my daughter. And I will reimburse it to you, even if possible, times three. You know I'm capable of doing that. So, get it into your fucking head. We are no longer in-laws. Get rid! Don't talk to me anytime. Get out and don't talk to me. Nonsense. I don't want to do that. Don't look at them. Stupid people. Eh? Stupid people. Hey! It doesn't got into that level, my in-law. Papa, please give me your pregnancy. What, what happens to Jeremiah? It's old fashioned. Uh, am I not old fashioned? I have to go school. What do you, what do you expect from an old man like me? Uh, what did you call your wife? Did you call her by her name, Amon? Uh, no, I call her the love of my life because she's my wife now. Hey, so give me a pet name before I leave this place, Papa. Hey, please, you, please don't leave. Please don't leave. Um, uh, uh, baby girl, you see. You hey, I like the sound of that one. What my you, baby. What? My baby. Yes. Oh, you like my baby? Yes. Okay, my baby. Hey. <laughs> Papa. <laughs> <laughs> um, what if my wife is there? And look at you, she likes to call you my baby. You still call me your baby? Now, eh? Yes. Yeah. It, it's not going to be easy. Oh. Okay, okay, sorry. I'll go. <laughs> my baby. <laughs> I'll call you my baby. <laughs> this love is sweeter than the one I know. I'm in love. Hey, hey, Martina, Martina, come, come, come here. Sit down, sit down. I'm always caught up. Any time Emeka tells me that to come and ask you sensitive questions. Eh? What are you hiding from me, this woman? What is it? What is it you think I'm hiding from you? For this long time we have been married, can't you learn how to trust me? Trust you? Yes. What is going on between you and Emeka? That's what me, I want to know. And meanwhile, who is this your relation that gave you this land that I'm dragging with Emeka? Who? Around him. That will be a question for another day. On a very good day, we shall talk about it. Mm. Yes. All right. One day, Monkey will go to the market and he will not come back. Uh, tell me, what did Mama Choma come to do here? Victoria came to warn us uh, that, that we should desist from calling them our in-laws because the daughter Choma is no longer interested in the union between our son, Smart, and herself. Mm -hmm. Did anything happen when uh, uh, Chioma visited uh, Smart last time? I wouldn't know. I wouldn't know. Chioma did not mention that to me. Maybe you need to call your son and ask him. Hey. But uh, 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 this issue of Emeka asking me to ask you sensitive question is still burning my heart. I don't like it. I don't like it, and I still want to know. Yeah, I really nani. want to know. Nani, you're getting me offended. Sim ni rupu abiko. Nke abuti gini. Pop ni rupiko. Amu. Leave me alone. I should pop. Yes. I should pop. Get out of my face. Eh, hey, just because uh, you hold me at work, most times with this your romantic gesture that uh, you are using to. Cause this time I run. All right now. 
Ah, one new can I fend us and cap again. I'm all governor, walk out of the way home was. You de marry me, let me say you be my yoga. No, they deride me, cause we'll get a good idea. One can set for Prisca. I invited you here to sort things out. You know, I don't like to hurt people. I don't know where we may meet again in the future. You get? So I want us to sort our differences out. Smart, you and I know that we are friends and lovers while it lasted. Thought I never know that you have extra two ladies in your life. Hence is your choice. I need to back out. Well, thank you very much for understanding. Alright? That's why I actually called you out here to apologize, to tell you I'm sorry. You were a nice lady while we did it. You never hurt me in this life. Hmm? Smart. Yes. Like I sounded initially does not mean that I'm not sad. I must tell you the fact. My heart bleeds for the insult I suffer for the hands of Jennifer just because of you. And that's what, what I'm actually saying. Alright? I want you to put the past behind you. Let bygones be bygones. Okay? Well, let's let's move forward. Please. I, I'm truly sorry for everything. Smart. Yeah. Are you actually trying to have me back in your life? No. <laughs> have me back. This is actually a farewell address. Yes, I I called you here to address you so we can have a peaceful pattern. I don't want you to see me on the way tomorrow and say, this guy is a very wicked guy. That guy, he broke my heart. You know, I, I don't want all of those. So I want us to have an agreement. You know, you're cool with it, I'm cool with it. You go your way, I go my way. You get? Ah, huh? where are you going? Let, let, me, let me give you transport now. But wait, oh, how are we going to not do we handle this pressure for people, people, my family, but just people, everybody? How do we handle it? I don't understand. I just didn't say you love me. I love you. Why are you asking me this kind of question? Listen, if you're going to continue like this, I'm a transparent just get up, dress up and leave this place. And that will be the last time you're going to be seeing me. No, no, if you no. love me, you should withstand any pressure. No, 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 no. I, okay, okay. I will withstand any anybody on my way. I will I, I, I would I, I would deal with anybody. Because I love you. I love you. I am sorry. You see, I, I why 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 should I? <laughs> when when you, you, you have handsome rich men and you decide to go for an old man like me, and I'll still be making younger. <laughs> I'm sorry, I love you. <laughs> you okay? I'm in love. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Papa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Mama, mm -hmm. Papa's number is still switched off. Eh? What's going on? He's unlike him. Eh? And maybe his phone is dead. And maybe there's no place to charge it. Let's just assume that's the situation. This is strange. Oh. But Mama, don't you think that I should um, run to Nze Romano's house? Maybe they have council meeting. Kitty, stop. You're making me scared. Eh? Don't make me scared. It's not late yet now. Eh? Your father knows we're coming back today. I know wherever he is now. He'll be hurrying back home. <sighs> oh, God. Oh, yeah, now. Let me run down to Choma's house. Before I die of boredom, yeah, I'm very bored. If Papa was here now, I'm sure he will make this place lively. Let me go. I'll see you later. Mkechi. So you had the intention of leaving me here, huh? 
Are you not just selfish? <laughs> oh, Mama, okay. You have started again. Your own, eh? Your own case is different. Oh, God, let me sit down here and wait for my darling husband. <laughs> okay, no problem. <clears throat> I'm, I'll stay with you. Eh? Go! Please go. Uh -uh. Eh? Let me stay with my beloved mother now. Eh? <laughs> Why do you like dragging this man with me? Eh? Leave me and my darling husband, please. Hey. Go, go to wherever you want to go to. Let me wait for you. Your darling husband is good. Chioma! Chioma! Yes, ma'am. Where did you go yesterday that made you come back late in the night? Well, Mama went to see a friend and then we went to see other friends. All together we had um, to go out and have fun. That you went out to visit some friends made you forget the ethics of this house. That no one stays beyond 8 p.m. Brother, please. Those ethics should be long dead. Come on, nobody is a kid anymore. We won't continue to answer that this girl and mommy's boy. We are all grown ups. Shama, is this really you? That is addressing me so proudly? Well, I see no arrogance in my speech. All I am saying is that you should give us some air of freedom. Yes, let us do what our mates are doing. And would you mind telling me what your mates are doing out here that you want to do? What am I telling me? What is wrong with you? What is wrong with you? It is not every time that someone stays in the mood to listen to your rant is like some mad dog. Stop it! Don't you ever in your life try that again. I am no longer the small child that you used to know. Shoma, Fodi. Shoma, come back here. For the second time, come back here, else you'll regret what I'll do. Ha! Did she really shout at me or what? I had a belly that. Chioma! Chioma! Ah. So you're supporting Chioma? You're insulting me? Me? Me, Victoria? Hi. She insulted me in this house. How? I was only protecting her from, you know, lacerating the skin that you cherish so much. And you are pushing blames on me. Well, what is it? Anyway. Why am I even complaining? Huh? Tell me, why won't Shoma snub me and walk out of my presence just like that? When you beat me before them? Yes, that was exactly the same thing that gave her the impetus, the audacity to do that to me. Oh, come on. She has every reason to, to insult me. Come on, Victoria. I, I was thinking by now you would tell me what transpired between you and Choma instead of rig my road in words, right? I, I hope you're right now. No, no, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Uh, how will I be all right? Eh? Well, where will I be all right? When by your attitude, you're giving Choma the go-ahead order to go out at will, come in at any time, even late in the night. Yet, you pretend as if you don't know what is going on in this house. Oh, come on. Victoria, I can see your frustration, but I'm not in for your indashable terms. Dr. Wisdom, you are mad. You are crazy for calling my word indashable. How could you do such a thing? Eh? Anyways, wait. It's just because my lawyer has not served you a divorce suit. You won't have the mouth to say this. Idiot. Nonsense. Me, Victoria. Insulting me. My love, this idea of coming back home very late and sleeping in the sitting room, is that a new formula? Yes, Papa. I mean, I've been noticing this since we came back from travel. What is the matter, Papa? What is happening? Talk to us. <sighs> My dear. The love of my life, I, I am sorry for such. You know, the royal assignments, personal engagements, and the rest, yeah. take so much of my time. I'm sorry about that anyway. But I, I don't understand. I, I 
mean, is anyone a stranger in this house? Eh, my love, did you, when did you become grossly engaged without our knowledge? Yes, Papa. Eh? Yes, Papa. Tell us. Because you don't get involved in any, uh, any assignment without letting us know. You don't. What is happening? You see, one thing you must know is this. Man is continually changing. Nothing is fixed. Today this, tomorrow that. That's the reason. Like I apologize earlier, I apologize for that. I'm sorry. My love, is there any additional assignment mm. this all I gave to you? Yes. Mama is right, Papa. Apart from the secretaryship, is there any other um, um, function that is all assigned to you? Please tell us. Too much questions. Too much questions. Asking me this, asking me that. What, 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 what is that? I have a lot on my mind. I have a lot of business to think about. Uh, what is this? Papa. Seriously, I am sick and I am tired of mother's control. It's becoming annoying. I understand, but then you're talking as if you don't know mom. I've overheard you and I think you shouldn't be arguing with her. So long as you're still living in the same roof with them, mom will always want to be the alpha and have control. She's very annoying. Seriously, I don't know what is wrong with that woman. Look, Chummy. Just pray that you graduate and move out of this house. Or better still, just get married and, and move on. But so long as we're here, mom will always be nagging and all You're that. You're right. I just can't wait. So all this rubbish can, can, can stop. Yeah. So that, that reminds me, I wanted to ask, have you uh, ironed out ish, the issue you had with the smart guy? I told you I do not want to hear that name smart. I'm sorry. Okay, just, I'm sorry. I'm just looking out for you. But I don't mean to upset you in any way. I'm sorry. Come on, cheer up. Tell me. <laughs> don't worry. You know mom and how she can be. Okay? Are we still going to I'm see? I'm not in the mood to go anywhere. Oh, fine, fine. Tell I don't like the fact that you came back from your outing late. And instead of you apologizing to your mother, you're rather busting the bubbles. Dad, please. You guys should give me some break. Give me some space. I am an adult and I can take very good care of myself. I don't like the way mother is going about this. The way she even sends spy to my school to even want to me. I need to mix up with people. Excuse me. Will you shut up? Your mother loves you dearly. If not, she wouldn't care if you are sinking in the highest ocean or perishing. I know that, father. But with the way she's going about it very soon, I think I'm going to be a public nuisance. I need some space. Oh. Choma, I understand all this, right? You might be fighting a just cause, but your, your approach to it is very wrong. Instead of, you know, rigmaroling into citing your right, you better go down your knees and talk to your mother in an apology form. Instead of insulting her. Yes, of course, she told me. You insulted her, and I don't like that. Father, so please, I never insulted mother. I only asked her for my freedom, and that's all. Listen to me. I want you to go in there and apologize to your mother. What? That's exactly what I want you to do. Your time start counting now. Ah, thank you. Hello, David. It's me. Oh. Come and sit down. Yeah. yeah. She just went inside now. Okay. Join us, sir. Okay. You're not looking bad. Oh, stop. <laughs> anyway, thank God for everything. Mm. It's not been easy. But... Ah, ah, thank you. <laughs> Hello. Welcome. Thank you. Look at you looking all beautiful on just a three day street. Mm. Mm. Are you sure you did not go to see your sweetheart or your boyfriend? No. I went to see my sweetheart with my mother, playing as referee. Your mother will not only be the referee, she will be the new video assistant referee. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. That's the arrow. Yeah, you're right. 
Oh um, my god. Oh. Okay. I can see you. About? Really? Uh -huh. You have a lot of gist for me, right? Uh -huh. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> I hope you people came back with the uh, bread. <sighs> we did though. But my dad almost spoiled the family joy that day. Ah, my dad. That has changed. Really? Yes. What happened? Can you imagine that my dad did not come home until late night that day? And, and I know my dad does not stay at least beyond 6 p.m. I don't know what's happening. I don't like you that. Exactly. He's not known for, for such. Yes. And that's why I was so worried. My mom almost died of high blood pressure that day. My dad has changed though. He's not the same man that you know. Maybe he has, I mean, the old man has decided to discover himself. Uh -uh. <laughs> what do you mean by the old man have decided to discover himself? We're talking about my father here. Well, let's just say I was with him the whole day. <laughs> oh, Choma, stop. What do you mean by you were with him the whole day? As in how? As lovers. We were together from morning till night. Chuma. Chuma, baby. <laughs> I, I, I have never felt like this before. I, you're such a beautiful girl. <coughs> uh, let, me, let me call Papa. you. Papa. Papa, yes. please, please, I beg you, tell me that what I just heard is untrue. Tell me, please. I don't understand. What is untrue? Papa, are you going out with my friends, Chioma? Come on, will you address me as your father? What, 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 what are you talking about? Papa, are you going out with my friend, Chioma, as in dating her? This is what we are supposed to discuss under a mutual understanding, not by shouting. Please, Papa, please. Please, just clear my doubts. Are you having an affair with Choma in any way? Are you? <sighs> Papa, talk now. Kichi, you come down. Try to understand. I, yes, I, 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 I love Choma. What? Papa, do you understand what you just said now? That girl is my junior. Kichi, why are you talking like this? I'm not sure you really fell in love once. When love hits you, it's a new world entirely. I have never felt the way I feel loving Chioma, your friend. She's just a wonderful girl. Both of us are in love. Try to understand. Jesus! I, I, I Jesus Christ! Papa! Jesus! Goodness! Mama! Mama! Oh. Mama! Mama, it? who is chasing you? I feel like vomiting, Mama. I feel nauseous. My stomach is about to explode. Uh, what is it? Uh, what did you eat? Uh, what did you eat? Do you have stomach upset? Mama, there is trouble. Mama, there is trouble. Abomination. Hey. hey. Please, you're making me scared. What is it? Mama, Shoma just told me now that she is seeing my father. <laughs> I just came back from Joma's house now and I went straight to meet Papa. And Papa confirmed it. Please, Mama. I don't understand. Mama, please. Can somebody just tell me that this is a dream? Pinch me, Mama. Mama, pinch me. I don't understand. What is wrong in Joma seeing your father or your father seeing Joma? I don't understand. Mama, Mama. Eh? Choma is now dating Papa, your husband. I mean, they are now having an affair. Lovers. <laughs> Lovers. Bam. How do you mean dating? How? When? Where? 
I, I, how? I don't know. I don't know. But you need to just go in there and confront your husband. The better for you. Look, the better Uncle for you. Look, Okechi. This is a very sensitive matter. It's not everything you joke with. Hope this will not end up being an April fool. April what? If it's an April fool, it's good now, Mama. I am telling you that your husband, your beloved husband, is now lovers with Shoma, my friend. My husband? Yes! Bam! And Shoma? Yes! You better go! In fact, I'm coming with you. I'm right behind you. My everlasting love. I am sorry. I, I, I don't know how the whole thing happened. Choma just swept me up my feet. My love. Are you confirming this to be true? Papa, please answer Mama. Is it true that you can go naked before Choma as lovers? Is it true? My everlasting love. It is true. Me and Chopper and I are, are, are in love. My love. You mean you have been sleeping with Chopper? Ah. Hi. Udokas me. Udokas killed me. me. Mama, 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 don't leave me, I will tell Mama, please. Get up. Papa, bring the water, please. Please. Mama, please. Mama, get up. Mama, get up. Mama, please now. Please, Mama. Mama, please, I'm here for you. I will be your everlasting love. Mama, please, Mama. Um, Gigi, hmm? I need to understand why you brought me to this place instead of your house or mine. Okay. You don't understand. I will tell you. I brought you out to this natural place. So that, in case anyone kills each other, she now go to the police and lay reports for murder. I... What did you say was happening between you and my father? Can you say it again? Because well, point of correction is not even words. It's X. It's a present tense. Your father and I are lovers, or didn't you confirm it from him? You are mad, Chioma. There's something wrong with your head. Yes! Okay, so you did not see... Anybody to fall in love with again? What happened to Smart? You now decided to, to fall in love with my own father. My father, why? Why, Choma? Well, let's just say because your father has all the qualities that I'm looking for. He's loving, he's caring, he's peaceful. He's an understanding man. Choma, may I imagine you strike your mouth for ever saying this to me. You are an idiot. You are a witch, a daughter of a witch for trying to disrespect my, 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 my family's peace. And joy and happiness oh, and happiness. What that rubbish, you idiot? Look at this state we talking with me. Because I can deserve myself so long to talk to a puppet like you. What the hell do you think you are to come and talk to me like that? Are you talking to me, Chioma? No, if I'm talking to you, what's going to happen? You must be mad. You must be mad. There's, there's something wrong with your head. Your family generation is there's mad. There's something wrong with your head. You're putting in that You are a witch. You're the one that's a witch. You're of a witch. Look at who is look looking at you. Oh my you look God. Look at you. Look at all that old man. Hey, you look at all of you. All the young, young boys. Young, 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 Hey, hey, a puppet. Puppet fool like you. For you, you have money, but you don't have sense. You're the one that doesn't have sense. You don't have sense. You don't have sense. You don't have sense. You should die on your own. That's why they're always broken in your house. Get out! You get out! Don't push me again, no? You push me. Stay away from my father. I don't want to have you. Okay, you don't have to fight my face. I don't want to fight my face. Stay away from my father. You think I'm like you, bro? You think I'm like you, bro? You change your color. Stay away from my father. We have problems. We have problems. And you will have problems. I'm going to be busy. Hey, okay, it's okay. 
Nkechi, anything that made you fight your friend, Choma, hi! That must be very serious and annoying. Hi! Please, please, please. Please. I am not just in the mood now. Please. I am very bitter. Can you imagine? Mm. Eh? Can you imagine what kind of nonsense is this? Eh? Hey! <clears throat> Nkechi, eh, I, I know. But I'm still sorry. Eh? But, Nkechi, anything that made you fight your friend, Choma, if it were to be another person, we would have been talking about that case by now. Kalista. Mm? Kalista. Can you imagine that? Shoma, that stupid girl, crazily, caught off a, 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 a relationship with smart. And that, that guy, Tio, yes, Tio, just to hook up with my father. My old father. I just, I just don't get it. I'm trying to 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 to, to, to rap like like I can I, I can figure it out. But <laughs> wait though. How? I don't understand. Like how? Kalista! Um, Shoma is now dating and sleeping with my father! <laughs> with my father, yes, my old father, Udoka, the same man that you know. Hey! Wait, though. Is she raving mad or infatuation? I don't know. I have no idea. I don't understand how a young girl will leave a young, vibrant man just to be with an old man. Hmm. An old man! Uh, uh, I, mm -mm. I, don't, I, don't, I don't get it. Mm -mm. I she did not try you. This huh? is wickedness unpersonified. Wait, did she give you any reason? I don't care! I don't care whatever reason that she has! She has no reason to sleep with my father. I don't care what drove her into my father's house. I don't care. Hey. Mm. I don't care. It's, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. You see, because of this, I will make sure that I kill that girl in this village. Please. I must kill that girl in this village. Inkechi. I must kill her. Inkechi, Inkechi, please. Inkechi, please. Inkechi. Don't say that again. Don't even loud it. Inkechi, these people are rich. They are highly connected. Me and you, we don't have any. I, I mean, I'm sorry. Don't, don't get angry. Don't even say that again, Obiko. Sorry now. Uh, wait, wait. Wait, wait. I'll get you, 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 get you see, for this love, no going back. I'm in love, I'm in love. Papa, 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 by stooping so low to date my friend Chioma, you have finally lost all the self esteem and respect that I have for you. You have lost it. You have lost it, Papa. You have lost it. You better watch your mouth. Watch your tongue. Mm. Because I can curse you right now for speaking to me in that manner. Oh, Papa. Papa, see how you have you have used your hand to scatter the family that you you you, you built just because of an animalistic uh, loss for, 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 for a little kid. For a little a, a little kid. One small girl. Huh? H hello? <sighs> You, you, you can't be serious. Thirty minutes ago. Okay, okay. So you, you went to, 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 to fight Yoma? You went to fight Yoma? Papa. Why did you go there? You slapped me. I, I will slap you again. Something wrong with you. Ouch. Are you mad? Do you know the joy I derive having Chioma as my baby? I touched the tiger by the tail. Don't, don't you ever try it again. Mama, I'm your daughter. Come, get out of my sight. You slapped me. Okay. No problem. We shall see. I will kill that girl. We shall see. We shall see. Okay, we shall see. 
we shall seize that girl and we kill that girl. Mama. What is it? Mama, yes. Papa just slapped me twice for fighting that girl. But you see this slap that Papa gave me? Because of this slap, I will make sure that I kill that girl. I will kill that girl, though. I will kill her. Please. Listen, it's not every battle you go to with gun and cutlass. <laughs> eh? This particular one needs prayer and dialogue. Please. Mama, please. Mama, please. You see this one? You see this situation? Eh? It needs violence. And I must apply it. I have to save my father from the claws of trauma. I have to. Okechi, don't forget that the first time I heard about this news, I fainted. But I weighed it spiritually and found out that this is more spiritual than physical. Please, my daughter, let us follow this thing with dialogue and spiritually. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, so what's, what, what's in your mind? Look, we draw from every physical, ah. every form of physical attack. Ah. Let us try dialogue. Please. Mama, Papa has gone far. Papa has gone far. I have to save Papa. Because Papa is being hypnotized by Joma. I have to save my father. I have to. My daughter, that is the more reason I said we need dialogue and prayers. We don't even know where this Ill wind is blowing from. Please. Mama. Mama. Mm. Ma Mama, please. I can't do this. Uh -huh. Doka. Oh. Nketi. 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 Oh, but you were done. To be honest with you, eh? You, you, you cannot believe it. You won't believe it to let the loan on me. Because me, Kalista, I did not believe it either. But then I heard it from the horse's mouth. Mm -hmm. To me, this looks like a setup. I mean, what will Chioma be looking for in Nani Joka? Of all people in this community. Forsaking smart. My dear, this is not a set of anything. Eh? But then, I am a friend and I say everything. We cannot say everything from here. Eh? Uh -huh. So, if you ask me, mm. this is not ordinary. Obahaka. I never can tell you. It might be ordinary. Eh? Eh? True love exists too. Let me tell you, true love does not consider age, creed, or even education. Eh? They may truly be in love. So I pop up. She you say you are a graduate. You'd not have sense. You might if you cha 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 cha. Must you insult my friend? Keep quiet. Which one is um, love, age? Wait. Nanyu Doka, that old man talking about love. And keep bazo no man. What does that man have to offer? Come on. Eh? Mm -hmm. It's not the way you say it. Hey. See, let me tell you. Hey. You might not know what has transpired between the both of them. Hmm? See, let me tell you. When you will see and know what is going on, that I foresaw this is coming. So relax. You're not a person. No. I know. You see that girl. You see that Joma of a girl. Or oh, Mandeli, that girl on Amma. That girl will not make heaven know. That girl is very, very wicked. No, she actually cost me. Me, Kalista, my Ashwabi clothes. And you expect me to be happy. I am so angry with that girl. No, take that. No, Nego the fine girl mm -hmm. She now went to be following that old man. Then she now left very sweet, young looking man. She left him banana. She left that boy, very fine boy. If you want to go, if you want to go, if you want to go, don't tell me that. Don't say such. Eh? Is it banana that she will chop? Or banana called Galata? Hey. Relax. See, let me tell you. Hey. They are both in love. Hey. She be in this community that we are. We will see to the end. Just to wait to Anya. Wait to Anya. Now yeah. I know it's Ashebi that is causing all these things. Leave me Ashebi. If not Ashebi, what will lead? Go home. Leave me alone. In fact, let's, let's, let's close boy. this matter. Leave this thing. Yeah. I am happy that I gave that stupid girl that calls herself to the beating of her life. 
Listen, I love that man and I'm ready to die for him. Imagine Katie Tricky sleeping me out to fight me. Well, I am happy I gave her the beating of her life. I'm politic for what? A man that loves me? A man that passes me like an egg? All like all those young boys that can't even keep to their relationship? That cheats around? I love him, but that's what matters. He loves me too. I'm looking out for you. Can you stand in the presence of our parents and see what you're just saying? Just listen to yourself. Like I said, I love you without reservation. And I can stand right in front of God to say the same thing that I just said to you right now. Do I sound like I'm going mad? Like everybody thinks I'm going crazy because I'm in love. Do I sound, am, 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 am I mad? Have I gone bananas? My love, the love of my life, what is actually happening in our house of late? What do you think is, is actually happening? I know you know, but I'll tell you, my love. What is your involvement with that little girl, Chioma? My love, I am sorry for the embarrassment. But the truth is, I, I am in love with that girl. My love, the love of my life. Have you forgotten the love, the joy, the peace we've been sharing in this home? Do you want to sweep that under the carpet? My love. The only thing constant in life is change. And if you do not move with the change, it will sweep you away. And so I want you to begin to understand so you can adjust. Adjust? Adjust to what? Udoka, adjust to what? You want me to adjust to sharing you with that little girl old enough to be your own daughter? Where is that intelligent man that I fell in love with and got married to? When last did we sleep together? You want that life to continue so that I die of, 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 of prostate cancer? No, tell me, you want me to die of prostate cancer? Doka, Doka, remember, we promised to love each other even till death. Hello. Do you know what it means flogging a dead horse? <sighs> Look at this homo sapien. Beat me! Beat me now! Beat me! Idiot! I was, I was so silly to have, to have believed in you in the first place. I should have known that you're my half brother. You don't have my interest at heart. Choma, are you the one vomiting this nonsense? You're calling me half brother just because I told mom something that will save your life and, and save this family from impending embarrassment. This noble family. You want to put down a name to shame? Look at who is saving somebody. Look at your life. No, take a good look at your life. Are you a sixty? Do you breathe to your nostrils? Because at this point, I think you breathe to your anus. Look at you. You're trying to save me. Your mates are out there.